Okay, I'm here at Miss Meadows, this parole office. As I told, I made a video earlier this year of how they killed a guy in there for speaking up himself. Um, last week, they killed another guy for speaking up himself. They came out looking for him because he was saying that they were violating his rights. Um, he left his bags sitting right there. When I left at 3 o'clock, his bags were still there. So obviously they had, had him. They got him. They got a guy in there now. I have his uh, video on my uh, small camera. And I can um, record from that camera. And I'll uh, show you who this guy is. Now they're violating his rights. And he's speaking up for himself. So this thing, I'll show you, put that ankle monitor on him real tight because he wouldn't bring his little daughter in for them to have sex with his child. So now they're angry. And like I said, he spoke up for himself. So now they hold him in there. He had the girl, but she, she doesn't have his back. So she went down there and went that way. I don't know where she's going. But people need to be protected. They tell me that's none of my business. It is my business because if you screw him, you'll screw me. And one domino fall, all the dominoes fall over. You understand what I'm saying? So they're holding him in there. They're holding him in there. And um, I'm going to stay out here because Miss Meadows came out. She wants me to leave now. She told me I've been here too long. She uh, unplugged my thing from the uh, cord. But they want me to leave so they can do something to this man. I'm going to be here a few minutes, but I have his, uh, they might try to send him to jail. He has no problem. He has no violations. He's just speaking up for himself. They don't like that. But I'm going to be here a while. It takes an hour for his anchor monitor to charge. Let me see, do they loosen it up or do they do anything to him? I want to see that young man walk out of there. You understand what I'm saying?